Please describe your job title and primary duties. I am an intern now for Victoria's Secret um, Home Office. I work for the event and incentive department, um, and we do events throughout the country um, for catering to their home office associates. So we do event planning from every aspect of the event and then actual execution. What was the work environment like? Um, it's a lot of fun. Um, I really enjoy it. Um, it's a team. We have a core team, so it's a pretty small and mighty team. Um, so one of the big things about corporate environment in, in general um, is you have to be a team player, have to be able to work well with, with team members, and also you know being able to adapt on your feet. It's definitely a fast-paced environment, um, so you have to kind of want to want to dive in and just make the best of every opportunity. Networking is key, and just kind of utilizing each day for what it's worth. What was your favorite part about working there? I'm traveling. I love the travel, and it's always great when you can travel on the company's dime, so that makes it even better. Um, so that's one of the big things um, I love about perk of my, my company is that, the company I say I, I work for, is that we get to travel a lot, and it kind of comes with the territory. So I mean, it's definitely long hours, but the reward is that you get to experience, meet new people from all over, you know, experience different menus, and really grow in your career, and your, your outlook on life changes with each day, so. Please describe a typical day as an employee. Well, I do logistics primarily for the team, so I handle a lot what's called pack up. So um, typical day kind of fluctuates with the demand of whether we're approaching an event or if we're kind of on the downturn of the event. But pretty much I handle any incoming and outgoing materials that our team would send out for our event. So anything that has to do with that is pretty much what I do every day. <laughs> How would you describe the application and interview process? Um, just it's almost like a regular job. You you know you have your interviews, and then you have your orientation, and then after that, it's pretty much there's a set time frame that the internship lasts, and you have different you know managers you report to, and different college recruitment staff that you report to, and then from there, there's a lot of room for growth and opportunity depending on how much you put into the opportunity. So, what questions did the interviewer ask during the job interview? Um, I think first off, it's kind of. It's a level of genuineness that you really have a passion for the industry. Um, with fashion in general, it's very, very fast paced. It's ever changing, ever evolving. So someone who has a passion for the brand because you know, I mean, every, like with any business, it has its ups and downs. And also, you know, you have to really be current on what's hot, what's not hot, what's trending, and how does that impact what you do in every department across the entire brand. You know, I'm kind of focusing on the customer because, you know, the customer is a person that really allows all of us to have our job no matter what company we're working for, particularly for this company is really, you know, being able to realize that everything you do inadvertently affects the customer and how are you affecting them positively throughout the day. What set you apart from other candidates? I think in general, whether it be limited brands or any company, it's really experience, especially at our age, the college level. Like a lot of people have great resumes academically, but they don't have a lot of field experience. So I think having the previous opportunity at Express, having that fashion actual experience, having a little elevated position in the field already, um, even though the companies were slightly different, um, they want to be part of each other. So just really long story short, is having that actual experience, like having work experience. I had another internship in the past as well. So kind of having something to back up the fact that you're getting your degree. I mean, there's millions of college students all over, but everyone's resumes are different because hopefully the experience that they bring to the table. So I think, you know, my unique background of having worked for various companies um, definitely separated me from other candidates. What other advice would you give to a job seeker looking to get employment? Um, I would say, like I kind of said earlier, is make the most of every opportunity. I think one of the biggest things I did when I first started was networked. Um, I took time to meet with people, go to lunch with people, pick their brain. Probably got a lot of people's nerves, but at the end of the day, um, I learned so much more about about my job and how I can add value to other people's jobs as well, and kind of really building upon the cross-functional relationships that already exist because of the job that you have, but kind of making them more personable. So I think that, to me, that was key because now, when I reach out, they don't just see me as the intern. They see me as a member of my team because that's how I established myself to be. So kind of 
claiming it before it even exists was my motto. I wanted people to know, like, I'm an intern, but I'm a member of this team. So how can I make both of our relationships better? How can I help you? But then how can you help me at the same time? So I would say definitely, like, network, network, network. That was definitely a key to my success, I feel. 